Hey guys, this is the Temescal Canyon Loop Trail. It's beautiful, it's just under three miles. It's in the Pacific Palisades, it's close to Santa Monica, LA, but you would not think you were anywhere near it. It is beautiful. I'm in the canyon now. From here, I'll show you, we're gonna get views of the ocean and the ridge. Hear that frog? And there's the canyon down there. If you want to do it, just go to hikingguy.com where I have all of the information on parking and maps and all that fun stuff. But otherwise, here are the turn-by-turn -turn directions. The hike starts at Temescal Gateway Park. And it's a little tricky to find the trailhead. There's a lot of parking lots. There is a fee. So again, just go to the website and I'll give you all the information on that. It's also a um, retreat here and you can have weddings. So there's a lot going on. But you're going to basically walk all the way to the end of the parking lots, almost straight in as you come in. And you'll see a sign there that says Temescal Ridge Trail and Temescal Canyon Trail. Um, we're going to take both of those. We're going to go up on the Canyon Trail, come back on the ridge, and just go straight. And over here to the left, there's this little staircase that goes up. This is kind of the beginning of the trail. Um, we're going to go up here. And once we get to the top of these stairs, there is another big junction. There's all kinds of trails coming in. There, that trail goes back down out to Sunset Boulevard. We're going to go uh, make the hard right. And you can see there's a sign there that tells us the trails. That's the Ridge Trail up to the left. And the Canyon Trail, Temescal Canyon Trail, is here on the right. And we're going to follow this. It's beautiful. It's serene. It's peaceful. It kind of goes above the buildings down to the right there. We could have also just cut through the roads down below, but what fun would that be? Let's do the trail trail. And we're going to keep going straight. We're going to eventually come back down kind of these buildings. And there's another confusing area where there's a bunch of trails that come together. And you can see here, we're going to kind of go straight through and then bear left. So we're going to go straight through this intersection here. And there's some picnic benches and areas for the retreat area. And we're going to go through here, and you can see it turns sort of into a trail here. We're going to come in onto this road here. Now, there is an interesting history to the retreat center. I have a whole link to that on the website. Go check that out. Um, sort of like an early version of TED Talks over 100 years ago happened here. But we're going to go straight, and then when we come through here, the trail kind of turns back into a trail, less of a road. Um, we're also going to start going into Topanga State Park, which is where the No Dogs Ordinance starts. So you could have dogs back there at Gate at a Temescal Gateway, but in Topanga there's no dogs, so don't bring any dogs past here. And you can see it sort of turns back into a trail trail as we climb up Temescal Canyon. And eventually you're going to get to Temescal Canyon Falls, which is right there. It's more of a trickle, and then. A minute up from the falls is this bridge. We're just going to go up and over the bridge. When there is rain, this is pretty um, much prettier than it is sort of at the end of the summer when it's really dry. But there's neat little views from the bridge. And we're just going to go straight ahead over the bridge here and start the last little climb that's going to bring us up to Temescal um, Ridge Trail. Now this is the steeper part of the hike. There's a little bit of climbing, but it's not too bad and it's not too steep. And as you go up here, you're going to get some pretty nice views into LA uh, as you go up. Obviously the views from the Ridge Trail are going to be nice in a minute or two. And just continue up on the climb here. And when you get to this intersection, we're going to make the left-hand turn. And you can see the trail is well marked. There's signposts all over, trail markers. We're just going to go up here do the little short distance to reach the Ridge Trail. Now, when you get to this next junction, you will be at the Ridge Trail. Sorry for the shake here, I'm not sure. Te technical issues. You can go through here and you're gonna to start to get your views um, up into the Santa Monica, Santa Monica Mountains, Pacific Ocean, Catalina. You can see Catalina back there. Then the trail continues off to the left here. And again, you can see it's well marked. We're up on the Ridge Trail, and the Ridge Trail um, often says Sunset Boulevard, points you back down towards Sunset Boulevard and the 
park, the Temescal Gateway Park. And what I like about doing the loop this way is that you come up the shaded canyon and then you come down the ridge, which has these sort of nonstop views into LA, the Pacific Ocean, Palos Verdes. You can see it all as you go down here. After a short while, you're going to come to this big, wide open area, which is a popular um, overlook. You know, a lot of people come here to see the sunset. It's a great sunset spot. And there's some little use trails around here where people find their special spots. But to continue on the hike, we're going to continue kind of bare left through that little area and continue down on the uh, Temescal Ridge Trail. And there's a couple little intersections here. This is the first one. And we're going to make the left here. And again, you can see it's all well marked. But we're going to make the left to head back down towards the park. And after a short while here, with some more views, we're going to reach the next intersection. We're also going to make a left. And head back down towards the park. That's just around three miles, a little bit under, depending on where you actually count the hike start. Um, but we're going to go down here, we're going to go through all these prickly pear cacti, and you're going to start to see the buildings of uh, the retreat in Temescal Gateway Park down below you. And then, right and then after a little while, we're going to come back to that intersection uh, that we saw earlier when we came up the stairs. And this time we're coming out where we mentioned earlier we would come out on the ridge trail. And the canyon trail that we went up earlier is back to the left here. And then you just go down the stairs and you'll be back in the parking area. And that's the hike. So that's the hike. It is an awesome one. There's a lot uh, crammed in here, a lot of bang for your buck. Um, if you're watching on YouTube, like I said, I have a full guide on hikingguy.com and there's a link to that article right under the video. So make sure you click on that and get all the parking information. There is a fee. Um, and also, if you're watching on YouTube, if you could do me a favor and click that little thumbs up, that helps other people find the hike and the video. So, uh, Temescal Canyon Loop, I'm getting bit up by flies right now, which is why I'm dancing around, dancing like a fool. But anyway, look at that. I can't beat that. All right, guys, I will, uh, I'll see you out there. Bye.